Hey guys, it's Syndicate here, and this is more information on the new map pack, and just like, you know, like kind of expanding on like the new resurrection map pack that's coming out. We're going to get the new zombie map, map pack called Moon. Finally, we all said, you know, we thought there was going to be a moon map pack, seeing as though there was ascension. So many things leading towards the moon, like a death ray, which being from Earth to the moon and back down to cause some sort of epic death ray, which we can't wait for, so I'd kind of like to see some sort of, you know, amazing, amazing, like, major weapon that I'd link towards the Earth, which could be the main way to kill the zombies you know like the final link so this is kind of like a, a theory i'm throwing out there it could be absolutely wrong but we all know there was uh like footage and information in derays that would basically link the death ray to be this um, almighty amazing like weapon that would kill the zombies back on earth because it went up to a satellite and came back down so let's say the satellite was actually on the moon and came back down and raped all the zombies so that would be the way to get rid of the zombies once and for all but then again, you know, it could be wrong. It could just not work out. And, uh, you know, like, zombie storyline is never obviously confirmed. And then, honest, if I have to be honest with you guys, my, my opinion is I don't think they will actually finish the storyline. Really, I don't think so. I think they'll leave it to the next Call of Duty. Uh, but they'll leave so many Easter eggs in this one. Like, like, literally so many Easter eggs in it that it'll be, like, impossible for us to solve. And we'll still be finding, like, Easter eggs out when we it comes to, I don't know, like, a year's time or two years' time with a new map like when the new college is out with the new zombie like maps and all that kind of stuff new storyline not new characters just new information for us to piece together because they've got such a good storyline here they're not going to break it up but what i wanted to talk about the most was um classic map packs we're finally getting them a lot of people are like can we buy them now and i know so many people have spent like 50 pounds i think 50 english pounds like up to like 80 dollars to buy the, the classic map pack so they could just play online with them simply and a lot of people have like you know campaigned to try and get them and they're finally giving them out in this map pack it's coming for free guys so you could say you were paying for free but we can finally say actually this is going to be a zombie map pack if you ignore the multiplayer maps you're getting five zombie maps so this is kind of crazy we're actually getting five so if you've been one of them, got them people. I was gonna say guys, then guys and all epic girls, zombie raping girls, who've been waiting to just jump on like Natural Totem, and Darius, you know, Numa, Verk, just to try and rape the zombies, see what's like on Black Ops, see what we weapons you can get from the box, see how different it is. It is kind of different. The zombies do act, react differently to compared to Black Ops, uh, compared to World of War, sorry. Uh, so it's an all, an almighty change, and you don't get like the same weapons from the box, or like you won't get the flamethrower unless they do an update, which I would actually like to say now, and I'd love to try and promote. Uh, to see if they'd um, put two sort of boxes. Now this might sound strange, but because we all know there's like the Black Ops box where you could like say you use it, and you get like the Famas or or like the Arg or something like that. But I would lo love to see like a box where you could also get the World of War weapons. So you know, like maybe two boxes around the map at all the time. I know it's a bit like contradictory of there being one box you've got to go to one place. But say there's two boxes, say you want to get like a cer certain old school weapon for like a World of War weapon. Uh, from the box you have to go to that box if you want a new modern weapon you got to go to the black ops web box so like two different style of boxes which would be really awesome like a black box and a normal box so the black box would obviously be black ops but that's just that's just like a suggestion i'd like to throw out there because it is good getting the new, like one one set of weapons and a good suggestion getting two sort of weapons but like if they put it in the in the same box it makes like the chance of you getting that weapon you want so much harder so it would be pretty awesome to see two boxes i would honestly like to say i'd love to see that but um, then again, you know, we can't. We I can't say this is going to happen. It's probably going to stick to the one box because I do have the classic map packs. Thank, thankfully, to a fan who actually gave them to me because I was going to get the hardened edition, so I knew I got them. But I was just like, nah, I never play them because at first I wasn't thinking zombies was that big. But I just made sure I concentrated on zombies to get it as mainstream as possible. And I don't know, guys, if I've done a good job of getting zombies mainstream for you guys, then please let me know. I've really tried my best to try and get it like pumped up because we all know it is the best thing about call of duty now yeah, you can say i'm wrong but you know i'm right call of duty black ops basically put its foot in the ground and said meh my multiplayer is all right but my zombies is epic <laughs> like my multiplayer is good but my zombies is better uh, but that's how it's gone down but basically everyone gets the classic map packs with this new map pack so if you buy it you are not just buying oh you get full multi multiplayer maps that you're not going to use if you're only a zombie player you will be getting four zombie maps which are your favorite maps that basically got you into the zombie storyline, got, got you into everything, all talk zombies. It can they'll oh sorry, I got hiccups. It will contain new zombie Easter eggs. Now I can guarantee this already because if you've played Black Ops on um, like classic zombies and played Sh uh, Shinonuma, you'll know there's like a new Easter egg where they talk about the Wonder Waffle, talk about time travel. So everyone knows like if you use the Wonder Waffle, 
Wunderwaffe. I think. How should we pronounce it? Wunderwaffe. There we go. Uh, too many. Too much time. Too many times or too repetitive. It will actually cause a time lapse. A kind of sort. Kind of thing. Um, and it'll rip a hole in time, so you like travel wherever you go. So that's how basically how they ended up in like all these other places. Except they did make the actual teleporter, which will teleport into a point in time. Maybe we're supposed to transport them to a different location, but it's, you know, different point in time in a different location. But this is way too much storyline to get you guys confused with, so I'm not going to confuse it too much. But this is just to say, like, you will get Sheen on Uma, Derise, Verux, and Natura and Toa, and I did kind of say them wrong way around. But uh, you'll get all the classic zombie maps with probably most likely the modern weapons with the modern Black Ops box. It would be good to see two, or like, you know, say if you could choose, I would kind of like to see that. Um, and if they did put, you know, say, the new perks into the map, so like Derise, you could actually buy seven perks in the game. I think, I think that'd be kind of good, you know, to mix things up. Not so, so like, we weren't just playing the same thing again, because I can see how, like, the old maps could come, become really boring to some people. So say they put the new perks in, new weapons in, which they will put, obviously put new weapons in, but if they put new perks in, that'd be absolutely awesome. So all I can say, guys, is I'm really looking forward to it. I hope you are as well. So... Don't forget to like and favorite this video guys because I am so, so, so pumped because so many fans will be able to get hold of the new map pack and I'll be able to play with so many so many more people um, because you'll be getting the new moon map pack which is called Resurrection. A lot of people were saying it's retaliation, you know, fear, spelling out fear, uh, but it's actually it's still spelling out fear but it's saying Resurrection. So finally, thank you Treyarch, I am actually super pumped to say thank you for this but um, because they all come out at the same time. I'm just going to be giving a massive, massive amount away. No, I'm not saying like a favourite because of that. I'm just saying that's how it is. This is for my fans. If you're just a new subscriber who's subscribing for it, you probably won't get it. This goes to my fans only. So to my fans of this channel and to Call of Duty Zombies, make sure you're subscribed. Make sure you like and favourite this video and I will be throwing out so many codes. I'm going to try and get as old as many as I can. I'm going to try and speak to track and see how many I can give away. Hopefully they'll kind of give me a few, just a, a f well, not a few, a lot, just to throw out because um, it's like a mainstream channel just for zombies. So guys, I'm pumped. You better be pumped. We're all pumped. Call of Duty Zombies for the win. We're getting five maps for the price of one. Does that make sense? Well, it usually does because we usually buy one and we get five and like four multiplayer maps, so five. But we're only getting one map. So now we get five maps for the price of one. I cannot wait. I hope you can't wait. And this is going to be epic. We're going to be rape training for days on the moon, like a, a moon train. Yeah, there we go. So, guys, thumbs thumbs up and like this video and favorite this video if you're looking forward to doing a, a moon train. <laughs> um, and I'm Siddiqui, guys. I'm going to be moon, train, moon rape training my ass off. So, uh, all the best and peace out.